DRDO has completed Project SIEG, successfully integrating software-defined radios into India's Netra AWNC aircraft to boost secure, flexible communication in contested airspace. Conducted by Center for Airborne Systems Bengaluru, the project finalized in August 2023 after over 50 flight trials, achieving 98% success. The software-defined radio upgrade enables jam-resistant, multiband, and encrypted links with other IF assets. With fleet-wide rollout approved, SIAG strengthens Netra's role in India's integrated air defense and future AWNC systems. इसका मतलब यह है कि नेत्रा मार्क टू ऑलरेडी डेवलप कर लिया ग्लोबल इंजन जायंट कमेंस एम्स टू लोकली प्रोड्यूस इट्स सेवन हंड्रेड सिक्सटी हॉर्स पावर वी टी ए नाइन ओ थ्री ई टी सेवन सिक्सटी इंजन फॉर डी आर डी ओ जोर वर लाइट टैंक ऑलरेडी पावरिंग द प्रोडोटाइप अनवेल्ड ऑन रिपब्लिक डे ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फाइव मीन वायल सी वी आर डी एंड अशोक With trials set for 2026, the Zorawar, a 25-ton high-altitude light tank, symbolizes India's push for self-reliance, as both companies vie to fuel its future under the Atmanirbhar Bharat Initiative. DRDO's Rudram-3 missile, a hypersonic air-launched weapon for the Su-30 MKI, has achieved major milestones toward production. Designed for suppression of enemy air defenses, it targets radars, bunkers, and command centers using a solid fuel ramjet and passive seeker, reaching speeds over Mach 5. Successful 2025 flight trials showed stable release and precision tracking. With production expected by 2026 and 200 plus units planned, it strengthens India's self-reliant air warfare capabilities. DRDO's naval anti-ship missile medium range is a new indigenous air-launched missile designed for the MiG-29K to strike enemy ships beyond radar range. Achieving key milestones in 2023, it features stealthy, sea-skimming flight, an ASA seeker, and a monic turbofan engine, reaching 350-plus kilometer at near Mach 0.9. Approved for trials in 2025, the missile will replace older KH-35 systems, with 200 to 300 units planned by 2027 strengthening india's naval strike capabilities anadrone systems has introduced shakti an indigenous long endurance loitering munition capable of striking targets up to 1000 kilometers away with a 25 kilograms warhead and 4 hour endurance Designed for precision, affordability, and mass deployment, Shakti bridges the gap between drones and cruise missiles. Featuring electro-optical infrared targeting, GPS or INS guidance, and swarm capability, it supports both offensive and defensive missions. Backed by the IDX program, trials begin in 2026, boosting India's Atmanirbhar Bharat defense goals. DRDO's LRD has received bids from Indian firms to co-develop and produce the Virupaksh ASA radar, a gallium nitride base system for the Su-30 MKI Super 30 upgrade, offering detection up to 400 kilometers and tracking for 100 targets. It will replace the Russian Bars radar, boosting the jet to 4.5 plus generation standards. The rupees 65,000 crore project involves HAL and BL. With prototype trials expected by 2027, marking a major step in India's self-reliant radar modernization drive. India and Russia are discussing the joint construction of ICE-class cargo ships to boost trade through the Northern Sea route, the shortest link between Europe and Asia. The plan, part of an intergovernmental working group. Includes cooperation on crew training and Arctic infrastructure. Russia's Rosatom, managing NSR development until 2035, reports rising cargo traffic and expanding its nuclear icebreaker fleet to support year-round navigation while maintaining strict environmental protection standards in the Arctic.
hacker group Black Mirror leaked Russian documents revealing severe technical failures in the Zukmi radar systems used in India's MiG-29K naval fighters. The reports show the radar's reliability fell far below promise levels with frequent breakdowns and falsified performance data between 2016 to 2018. Despite Russian attempts to fix the issues, the Indian Navy decertified the radar in 2019, grounding several jets. The leak highlights growing tensions in Indo-Russian defense ties and raises questions about Russia's export quality amid sanctions and internal disputes. India's Aeronautical Development Agency has issued an RFP for Indian companies to design and build advanced iron bird test facilities for the AMCA's fly-by-wire control system. The project, to be completed in 26 months, at ADA's Bengaluru site, will test the aircraft systems before flight. This marks a major step toward India's fifth-generation stealth fighter program, emphasizing self-reliance under Atmanur Barbarat. The AMCA prototype is expected by 2028 to 29, with HAL, BLLNT, and private firms like Tata and Adani vying for key roles in the rupees 15,000 crore project. DRDO is advancing its secret futuristic unmanned fighter aircraft, FUFA program, India's twin-engine, stealth combat drone designed for autonomous high-speed missions. In 2023, DRDO finalized the design, completed the preliminary design review, and began aerodynamic testing using wind tunnel models. The tailless, stealthy FUFA will feature internal weapons bays, AI-driven autonomy, and a possible Kaveri-based engine for supersonic speed. With private industry partnerships, over 80% indigenous content, and integration potential with manjets, FUFA aims to revolutionize India's air power alongside the Guttuck UCAV. That's all for today, hope you liked this video. Please like, share and subscribe for daily news updates. Thanks for watching.